What up, what up, what up, what up, my people? What up, my people? Welcome to another Castro Plus video. All right, we go. Woo. This is this is hitting, okay? My trout, I know. You love my trout. You're probably clicking this video because I'm talking about your favorite baseball player. My trout. Now, you here in the video, this is all from YouTube, but it's good to talk about it right now because I heard a lot of kids that we have, a kids that I know, they're a fan of Mike Trout. Oh, they love Mike Trout. They love Mike Trout. Mike Trout. And I love Mike Trout too. I think yeah. Mike Trout is a, a, no, it's a, a great good, player. A great he's an player. awesome player. Good human being a thing. Uh, yeah. It's just very respected. No, he's a great player. Oh, uh, but this is a difference about being a player, professional player, and being a coach. Mike Trout can be your hitting coach. Unless you feel what Mike Trout feel, okay? Hmm. This is the thing. In my age, when I was playing, my Mike Trout, it was a -Rod. Yep, that's true. a -Rod was wow, the, yeah. the one I look up to. Yeah. So they both believe the same thing, and they feel the same thing. The problem with this you as a fan, you stop listening to your coach or somebody that have a different view than your favorite player. And you as a mature player, you just acting like, ah, no, I'm gonna do just exactly what Mike Trout is doing or what he's saying. I was more, I'm gonna do what I read is doing mm -hmm. so because I want to be in the big league like him and I want to be with the green eyes and I want to be the, the cool guy. dude like him I, yes so the reality is today the internet is winning yes and there's a lot of information out there hey man Ooh. hey man preach that hey man uh, in my time it was just my space Facebook, maybe. Facebook, not even that much. Okay, so it was not hard YouTube like no. today. And it was whatever you see on ESPN uh -huh. or Sports Center. ESPN got control of my mind in that time. Yes. So here you see the feeling that he <clears throat> think he do in the games. In the game. Let's oof. And you see Aero is like helping him, like, yes, right, right, I yeah. do this too. Like, talk to everybody and tell him, tell him, you're the best in the game. Mm -hmm. So you know what you're talking. They probably know what they're talking away here in their head, in their body. But when you want to teach another player, they don't feel the same. So if you're teaching kids feeling, you can be wrong sometimes because it don't feel the same as other kids. It's like if I pinch you this hard, maybe you pinch me that hard and it's gonna be hurting me more. You're feeling different, you feel it different. You feel it, I feel it different. Yes. Maybe in the same spot. But you feel it different. But maybe for you it don't hurt, but for me it hurt. It hurt. Yep. Get it? So that's the feeling. He think the barrel goes straight and down to the ball. And look at they're happy about to saying this. And I bet little kids is following this. I know, and Aaron is happier now to say that now because he even knows that there is technology proving that you know they're not doing that. And and the way the, the way he tried to protect himself is saying, no, now this day everybody wanna teach lunch angle. And he do it the wrong way too. And he do it wrong. Lunch angle is something that is gonna happen no matter how you swing. You can swing down and you have negative launch angle. Or maybe you hit it under swinging down and you got a positive launch angle. Yeah. So the angles that he's talking about is the finish that everybody <coughs> players finish, how they finish, right? So have that feeling is different of what they really do. And this is what where I'm coming. We've been helping a lot of kids. And we've been doing long enough, this, this long enough, and that's what we like to do, what we love. And it's hitting coaching. I mean, coaching, hitting. Coaching, coaching hitting, hitting, coaching batting, or however you want to call it. 
because it's a lot of misinformation in kids just because they're fat and they just watch this in the in the living room. Dad watching baseball. They see my trout hitting the ball, and this is what is he's playing the hitting. So I feel like somebody had to have a voice, and I know a few uh, hitting coaches. They're already coming out and saying the truth. But look at what it's not any movement going down to the ball. The barrel is going back. The barrel is going back first. And then it looked like it's going down, but no, like this. Right here, you can see the barrel is just going straight down. And the problem, when you got the barrel going straight down with that energy, normally that barrel end up down in the ground and then you finish around the ball or rolling over. Or rolling over. Because it's hard to stop. It's hard to stop that. So the the ball is coming in this angle. How are I gonna hit a ball doing this? That doesn't make sense. That doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. But for A Rod and Mike Trout, that's what they think, and that makes sense for them. And you don't want to stop something that is working for them and making some millions, right? Yeah. But if I got a kid with nine years old and just start learning about the world of baseball, why not come with the right information from the get-go? And then the confusion is going to be less because they're going to find different coaches through this, through the stage of their life. But when you got a really good communication with the kid and, and the kid had the right information, it's going to be hard for the kid to get struggles. Look at the barrel going back. Right there. Almost like a hitting the catcher's net. Catcher's net. And then this is going to end up finish up. The reason the bat finish up and get on playing with the ball is because the energy that he put in the first. Which is back. Which is back. He don't go nothing. It, it going down if you want to see it like that, but it's not the way he is playing. He explained it. Okay. Um, so I wish I had what I'm doing right now when I was 12, even now, when I was in college. You, this, this information, it probably can change my career. Or even before you got recruited. To go to college. Before I got recruited to go to college. Even or got that, drafted. When I get drafted, if I knew this, I would sign with more confidence. Oh, you would have been, I'm 200% sure that you would have been in the major league. I, at least making it. Yeah. Because, because I got the size. I got the athletic ability. But the problem is, when you get the wrong information, it can be dangerous. Mm-hmm. And your career is going to be less... Longer, it's gonna, it's gonna. It's not gonna last long. That's true. It's not gonna last. Nope. And it's a reality. I don't know you. Some of y'all, not not y'all guys that subscribe, but some haters gonna think, nah, y'all. If y'all think y'all know it all, dude, I'm trying to give you the right information with the videos that is happening. What is happening here? It, this can be your career change. Yes. Take it. Or leave it. I'm gonna move on. I, I, I'm trying to give the information for the people that wanna learn and they wanna take the information for the good stuff. I mean, subscribe. I, we appreciate you subscribe. We're gonna bring more information about this, but you have to open your mind if you subscribe. Yes, because we're gonna be with the real stuff. If we're wrong, we will say it. But right here, I promise you. We're right. 100%. We 200% right. Okay. 200% right. So, I don't know. If I forget something, I, w- I will come out with something later. We're saying we, another video. We put in videos every day. And we try to bring more players like that. Comment below if you think, like, talk about any other baseball player, the uh, video analysis about it. Or any situation. Or any situation. Comment below and we will do it. 
and see what what brings us. And we maybe you interest on listen what we got or yeah or Let's playing video it. games whatever. And people, thank you for watching. We we'll see you on the next video. See ya. See ya. See ya tomorrow. See ya tomorrow. Tomorrow.